G'day and welcome back to our Rights of Pizza campaign in EU4. So we've uh, already got the Not Just Pizza achievement. Was trying to uh, do the Shadow Kingdom thing. Um, Romagna is the only province that has to be added to the HRA. Although, I mean, everything is owned by HRA members, so I'm not sure if it has to actually be added to the HRA or if it just has to be part of a member of the HRA. Do you know? Mantua, yeah, he is a member. Hmm. I guess we'll find out how that's going to work. Has embraced feudalism, has embraced renaissance. Okay, well, we can't go and take Romagna anyway, because our truce doesn't end until after the Shadow Kingdom event is going to fire. So I guess we'll find out how that's going to go. And otherwise, Corsicans. Alright, we are not going to go sorting out them. Let's give them autonomy. Friuli and Genoa. Friuli is probably going to take too long. Just start them ticking down. And then Genoa. Yeah, it's probably going to happen as well. Do it while we're thinking about it. Let it start ticking down. Event happened. Clergy losing power in Aragon. Alright. So we are kind of safe for now. Need a larger army though, I think. Ah, uh, the manpower. Yeah, seven men short. And Poland is Papal Controller. What is our gain rate? 0.66 per year. Due to their opinion of us, yeah, we should probably try and vassalize them. Can't remember what the triggered modifier actually does for that. Uh, not the occupation, subjugation. Deploy rep goes down by two. Well, that would kind of suck. Probably better off just destroying them. Although then you get no papal influence anyway. Okay. We're done improving with the Ottomans. Could we possibly get them on our side? Not really. <clears throat> Alright, unrest or lose prestige. What do we need prestige for? Alright, and the other thing was, these guys down to 20%, and they would still vote for the current emperor. Legitimacy and prestige, we just really need our guy to die. Alright, there goes the natural scientist. Um, tax, <coughs> inflation reduction, if we could afford it, which we can't. This guy's just going to be all about the tax for a while. And then, what are we? Well connected, well advised. Okay, um, the other thing. What was there? Something else I was about to look at. Hmm. Do you want to get back ahead of time? Help deal with the corruption. Uh, that was your thing, it was our age. Alright. If we die, there would be a Regency. Regency would be perfect for getting rid of this. We can't take any more land, even if we wanted to. Alright, truce with Luca has ended. It's entered the coalition immediately. Looks like Provence is screwing with Burgundy. That's nice. And where's in? Damn it. <laughs> Alright, here comes another big one. Ottomans have honoured with... Son of a bitch. So, we're at war with the Ottomans. Who are going to roll through Poland and they'll have access down to us. So we've got France and Austria. If the Ottomans weren't in there, we could have had it. What is our chance of separate piecing them? We would have to give them land over there. Once concessions other than gold. Um, yeah, the whole length of war issue. Don't suppose we could just... No. Need them to start occupying things. Alright, well. We will come down to Siena. 
Maybe head up to friends. You can do anything, or do something up there. Do you know it's under attack, of course. Um, these guys will sit in Siena for now. Do we have to worry about fleets? We have to worry about the Ottomans. I actually have to worry a lot about them. Alright, let's pull in here. Hmm. You know what? We'll have one go at getting past. And what do we have to do? Show superiority. That's not going to happen. And we did run directly into them. Right, 20 seconds. There we go. Run away to Siena. Started with 9, lost 1, ended up with 9. Okay. We're already starting up here. Hopefully everybody else sticks together. Their only war, their only war, and it's their only war. Unfortunately, Bohemia and Pomerania, all of the North German states. Alright, reinforcements there. Might get in in time. Not quite. I was about to pull in. That's the Ottoman army there too. That's very unfortunate then. Actually, how did the Ottoman army even get through there? Must have got access through someone else. Alright. Well, we're at minus 10 already from six battles. Okay. What is our chance of peacing out? Can't even suggest. There we go. Suggest offer. We give Ancona and Umbria. We release Siena, Urbino, Aquileia, and Corsica. And we are now overlordship of the Platinum. Screw you. We're going to try and hold out. It's all going to come down to how well the French and the Austrians can coordinate with each other. Naples is at war. Yeah, there's no way to get anyone else involved. Alright, got a breached walls. Maybe while they're doing battles we can sneak in and take enough forts to get some power. The ability to gain loyalty. Or gain prestige. We shall gain prestige. We need every scrap that we can get. You know, I've been throwing away prestige every chance we get. France, give us money. Nice. Utrecht. Whatever. And now the others are going to join a separate coalition. They should be small enough not to bother us though. Do, 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 do. Come on, we just want to form Italy. No big deal. Alright, Austrians are there. Um, where's the French army hiding? And what the hell do Castile think they're doing? Defending against Burgundy. Okay. Oh, we've won Ferenz. So, next one would be Parma. I think we do just want to head around there. Yeah, we're actually at war with Luca. It's level 3, that's level 2. So we'll do Parma. And if we have to, we'll come back down to Luca. Of course, we'll have to. We're going to still be massively negative on the war score. Hello. Won a couple of battles. Here we go, the Shadow Kingdom. Well, the Kingdom of Italy is still formerly part of the HRE. Been in many ways, it's turned into the Shadow Kingdom. So, yeah, they've all left just because of that one province that wasn't in it. Um, our country is a natural part of the Empire. Do you know what? Mantua, Milan, Savoy, Luca, and Florence don't like it. We don't care. We are staying in the HRE. So, there's a big gap between, which I guess will help us take out some of that land. And it'll help with the imperial authority when we start adding things back to it. One of the electors is a subject state. Right. Sorry about that, guys. Um, too bad. Can only improve a tiny bit more. And they are absolutely stoked with us because imperial authority confirmed. We will want to... Keep improving with France, I guess. I'm not going to use the guy for anything else for a while. Oh, looks like Austria won a little battle. 
go down and take care of Luca after we've done everything else. Okay. Hmm. And the Spy Master's dead. Okay. It gives us absolutely nothing that we can afford. So, trade efficiency it is. And we can get Diplo Rep. Fantastic. Development cost, not a huge issue. Should probably do tech for Diplo next. Actually. Um, six and six. Yeah, we'll take the admin tech. We'll take the Diplo tech. We'll switch over to the um, admin focus after we've caught up on Diplo. And Poland's out already. Crap. Poland give Bohemia stuff. And that means we're half their size now. So we've got to piece out. Needed to piece out while we could hand over pieces of Poland. If we'd hand over a bit of Austria, it's not going to be enough. Linz. Alright. Offer tribute. Clear the offer, obviously. We could revoke our cause. They don't want it. Return cause. It's all us. How come we can't hand these over? It's Bohemia. Bohemia holds it. Alright. Suggest a new offer. Ancona, Siena, Urbino, Aquileia, and Corsica. And lose the planet. No. Um, the other thing was the Ottomans. If we could piece them out separately. Can't even suggest anything. He wants nothing. He really wants nothing. We could annul our alliances. That would just leave us open to the next coalition anyway. Uh, war reps. He wants concessions other than gold. He doesn't actually want any concessions. Yeah. The Ottomans are the one that's really flipped this. If they didn't come in as an ally, we would have had this defense. Chidum! Alright, this one, hopefully we can hold out. Not if they're going to reinforce, god damn it. Holy crap. Okay, obviously we need to get out. We can't control it anymore. So let's just go next door and die immediately. Can't even pull out because we're trapped. Hmm. And because we'd have to wait till the end of the month. Alright, let's get our men the hell out of there. There's some Austrians there. Federigo, no! Alright, there goes our army. We have absolutely no way to win this war. It's just going to get worse as the war score grows. Pomerania. Yep. And now we're going to lose our fleet. Fantastic. 8th of October. Get to Siena. And we lost 3. Because 9 minus 6 equals 6. Thanks for that handy bit of maths there. Paradox. And yeah, the French. The French. The French army can't hold out. So yeah, we're pretty much utterly screwed in this. Um. Suggest a new offer. Ancona and Umbria to the Pope. Verona to Venice. It's left to release everybody else. It's a hundred peace deal anyway. So there's no reason not to hold out. And see if we can offer other people's land eventually. France will hold out for a while. Austria about to lose their capital. Arrogant administrators. And the general, general is dead. Advancement to the nobility. Alright. And we can get some tech. That'd be admin. Unlock another idea group. What I was going to go for was uh, humanist. 
to get the idea cost reduction and use the separatism reduction and all the rest of it. We're obviously not going to be doing them for a while. Trier, Burgundy, Mantua. All going to join the coalition. They'll declare war straight away. Just with Barden and everything else. Okay, can we hand over... Still can't hand over Austrian land. Why can we not give that up? And there goes the big truce. So, watch this coalition form. How are we actually looking here? Uh, 50s, 60s. Not enough to negate the next coalition. And everybody's entered. So, here comes the end of Naples. The great power Castilian have intervened and joined our enemies in the punitive war, as if that would help them. Well, it does mean that Castile... How much of an army does Castile have? 12 to 16, yeah. It does mean we'll get a uh, truce with them when we capitulate. Ancona and Umbria. So we're still not allowed to give up anyone else's land. No, Nevers to Nevers. They don't want it. Which is stupid. Alright, let's take the suggested offer. Want to do it before the other coalition fires, so we still have France and Austria on our side. Um, have to cancel our subject, have to release Aquileia, Corsica, Siena, and Urbino. Corsica, Siena. Aquileia will just be Friuli. And what was the other one? Urbino. They're just there. Now yeah, screw it. Let's just send that. We capitulate. Kind of even losses there. And the coalition now is most of the rest of Germany. Milan has rivaled us. And the Pope is still vassalizable. And we don't have a truce with him. Couldn't call anybody in because Austria and France aren't stupid enough to fall for that. And we're losing our great power status. Uh, quite significantly with that amount of development we just had to give up. We did keep Genoa though. Treviso is ours. Yeah, we gave up Verona to Venice, gave up Friuli to Aquileia. Baden is going to declare war. What else do we give up? These three. Alright, Frankfurt's the free city. And here comes the next coalition war. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Assume everybody accepted. Austria, France, Poland. Poland back in. And how's this stack up? Mm, pretty badly, because they haven't had a chance to rebuild their forces yet. Alright then. What do they want? For tribute. See Treviso to Venice. France will see Dauphiné to Provence. Who declared? Arkin. Naples gives Genoa to Genoa and give Arkin stuff. Um, sure, why not? Thank you, allies. It was very helpful of you. And Hungary, we can get a royal marriage. Wouldn't be quite enough. Um, Castile, we can get a royal marriage. They're even further away. Right, let's just go for Hungary. So, 164, because of Poland. Bohemia hate us, no matter what. Alright. And yes, we're obviously going to lose great power status. Disloyal estates. No, no brothers. And we should have no issue with coalition anymore, should we? There's still a few that think we're aggressive still. And we are actually perfectly back to how we started, except we've kept the core on Treviso. Alright. Well, that fell apart really quickly. <laughs> Surprised we actually survived that first coalition war. 
but we did manage to get an achievement not just pizza so what i think i'm going to do is end this campaign here we'll do a restart um not sure if we'll do naples or do some other italian but we'll go for the italian ambition um achievement still anyway so thanks for watching hope you enjoyed it let me know what you think in the comments and hope to see you again soon with something a little different see you later